There, you're in camera. Good boy. Hello, family and friends. Welcome back to my channel. This is Lauren, and I have something super exciting to show you guys. Last weekend, I ordered a plant off of Etsy, and guess what? It arrived today! Today, I'm just going to take it out of its box and pot it down here. Hopefully, it won't be a super long video, and hopefully, I don't mess this up. I have three different types of soil that I'm going to use today. Potting mix, cactus mix. And the last one, perlite. Perlite and a pot. This is just a plastic pot. You would not believe how hard it is to find pots right now. I have searched for so many days. I'm sorry, it's not pretty. It's the only thing I could find. I have no idea how much soil I'm supposed to use right now yet. So I'm just gonna mix it together. What I'm gonna do is put three parts of this soil to the one part cactus soil and just a handful of perlite. Oh, this soil looks so pretty. I'll show you how to do this. It looks pretty good. I don't think I'll need perlite. I feel like I need more soil. I'm not particularly sure. Let's see what happens. I'm gonna fill this pot. First, gotta mix. The other thing you should not worry about when you have plants is your manicures. Oh boy, it gets dirty. Okay, let's fill this pot. First step for potting a new plant is fill it one third full of soil. Okay, now that we've filled this pot third full of soil, now we actually get to see what kind of plant I ordered. Why do I always have such a hard time opening boxes? Please be okay. There we go. It's open. I wonder if I should do this closer to you guys. I'm so excited. It's like wrapped in paper. It's taped to the bottom. Ugh. Oh man. This is taking a long time. Man, I packaged this really well. It's just a bunch of paper. How hard can it be? I need scissors. There we go, guys. You see this? So yeah, I have a baby Raven ZZ plant. Let's go ahead and pot her. I feel like there needs to be more soil because I want her a little higher up. Let's just do it. Since you're such a little one, this is the first time you've been in soil. There we go. She's so beautiful in her pot. Oh, and this is a six inch pot. I hope it's not too small. I hope it's not too big, but we shall see. And it is drainage holes. I should have shown you guys the drainage holes before I put her in the here. Yeah, guys, look. She's in her pot now. I'm gonna go ahead and water her now, and then just leave her close to the window and see how she does. Hopefully I'll have a good update for you guys and it won't just end terribly. I really hope it doesn't end terribly because look at her. She is so gorgeous. Thank you for watching, guys. Time flies when it's the holidays, right? Hello, guys. Welcome back. Oh. Guess what? It's Lauren from the future. It's been about two weeks now and just wanted to do a quick update. After only like two days of having her, I decided her name is Zora Zarelius. I know, very weird name. This is her. Say hello again to Zora Zarelius. I do have to admit, I made a few mistakes with this little plant, but ZZ plants are very, very easy to take care of. No hard feelings, right Zara? Please don't hate me. First mistake I made is the pot. I hate this pot. You see these drainage holes? These drainage holes are lies. They're lies. The drainage holes, they don't drain at all. So every time I water her, which has been twice so far, I have to actually like tip it out. And it's a little nerve wracking for me because I am a little anxious when it comes to plants. Besides that, she seems pretty happy. 
I also made a mistake of putting it too close to the sun. So let me see if you can see. There are a few spots on her leaves. I'm pretty sure that's just from the sun. I moved her a few days ago out away, further away from the sun and she's been happier. No more new spots appearing. And also I have noticed new growth coming in. Tell me your worst mistake that you've made because I feel a little bit of like a dunce right now. <laughs> a little dim. I hope you guys are having a much better week than I am. It's been intense guys. And I hope to see you guys in the next one. And don't forget, like and subscribe. Love you guys and see you later.